Hello people, and here I have today to show you is the Albanian coin set from 1957 and these are also minted in 1947. They are made of zinc and they are pretty simple. They have stars around them, which is pretty popular with communism, you know. Oh, a lot of communist flags have a star on it. And in comparison, at the top, I'll show you the Yugoslav to dinner, 1945, and then the bottom is the German Den Reichsveni. Okay, now these, these coins are pretty, are the same size as the Serbian coins issued under German occupation, except that the 5 leek and the 5 dinar of Yugoslavia was a 10 dinar in Serbia. These coins are uncirculated, but as you can see, over time, oxidation takes its toll on the zinc. And as you can see from the coin above and below, they turn black from like a silverish colour. Okay. Now, these came on the market oh, a few years ago, quite a lot of them. Probably... The central bank in Albania had a lot of these coins left over after they were um, re-denominated in 1965 at one leak equals 10 quintars or one new leak equals 10 old leaks. Okay, as you can see, this is the singular and the plural in Albanian, which is an Indo-European language, is quite different. And also, I would, what would you call that? I'm not too sure. Liku. So that that's like a half denomination. It's probably also. I have to look up the linguistic term for that. Okay, here is the reverse. Has a coat of arms of Albania, which has a communist star. And it's pretty much the same as the Yugoslav coins. And there is the German swastika eagle. Now, I put the Soviet coat of arms there just to show that pretty much communist coat of arms are pretty much the same. It's surrounded by reeves, as you can see here, there and there. And usually there's something representing in the middle. This is a globe with the hammer and sickle. Albanian eagle. And this is probably flames. Represent reborn, the rebirth of Yugoslavia. Okay, so here I have the sides of them. As you can see they're all plain. The one that is reeded is the Yugoslav coin. And that's the same with all the Yugoslav coins that are all reeded. But I don't have them at the moment. I sold them. Anyway, this is actually one of my favourite coin sets, and if you like them, let me know. Albanian coins are quite fascinating to me. Okay. So there you go, there are the coins of Albania 957. Please like and subscribe, and let me know what you think. Bye bye.